It's my first time ever here at Holiday in the Park at Six Flags Great Avengers. So without further ado, all this and more coming up next on PA and J Thrills. I can tell there's a lot more to do here at Holiday in the Park than uh, Christmas Candy Lane. I've been going to Christmas Candy Lane for years, and this is my first time ever to Holiday in the Park. So, surprising, uh, Superman is open, and I just saw Nitro going, which is a shame because, uh, which is great because Candemonium has been closed uh, during Christmas Candy Lane so far at Hershey. Um, so, I did see it testing Candemonium at Hershey testing this week, so it may be, it may open this week, but who knows? But uh, yeah, they got a lot more to do here at Holiday in the Park compared to Christmas Candy Lane. There's the uh, Holiday in the Park sign. About ready to head in. And just like that, we are in. They're actually blowing snow in the park, which is the first, because I've never seen that before, so that's interesting. Joker over there. Yeah, I'm gonna head back to Nitro and Jersey Devil. Just like Hershey Park, uh, Great Adventure also has these s'more areas where you can uh, roast some, some nice. They uh, they uh, definitely feel, it's definitely great when it's really cold out. Uh, but yeah, I really like it when they uh, do that. Back in this area of the park, you have Batman that's open, Nitro, and Jersey Devil that are all open. So it looks like Jersey Devil is not ready to open yet, so we're gonna head over to Nitro. You can hear it going.
So the one thing I don't like is that they're literally blocking four out of the nine rows here on Nitro. You know, you have a full station here. You know, you have a line down there. Why are they blocking off these rows? That's just something I don't get. I also noticed that they were doing that for Batman as well, so I, I don't know how I feel about that, especially if you're like getting a long line. I don't really think you should really be doing that. There's not really a purpose that I, would, I can see, um, but yeah, those are just my thoughts on that. Decided to get dinner over here by the brew house, so let's get some entertainment and some turkey mashed potatoes and corn and cranberry sauce, which is one of my favorites. Um, yeah, yeah, this is awesome. It looks like Houdini is still closed. Not that, that's sad. Superman all done. Uh, that was actually the first time I ever rode in the front row. I've been coming here all season. I haven't done Superman in the front row. We got into the station. There was literally no one in line. Um, so, yeah. Um, definitely, so far my thoughts, I really like Holiday in the Park much better than Hershey Christmas Candy Lane. Just because there's, there's a lot more here to do. 
like with Christmas Candy Lane, um, well, now that Candemonium is closed, you only have like Super Duper Looper, um, Laugh Track, which is always the longest wait in the entire park. You have, uh, Jolly Rancher Remix and, uh, uh, in case you can't tell, there's not really much available at Hershey Park right now. So, literally the only reason I'm going to Hershey Park for Christmas Candyland is literally just to film construction updates for Wildcats Revenge. But, like, when I go, like... They only have a cup, like four roller coasters open. Here, pretty much everything except King Ka, El Toro, and Medusa is open, and Green Lantern. Those are the only four roller coasters that I can think of that are actually closed here. So, yeah. Those are just my thoughts so far. I really like the event. They're starting to turn the lights on for Holiday in the Park. It's looking great. Now take a walk over here down where Joker is. Everything's starting to be lit up. Looks like a wildcat right there. Loving these light displays that Great Adventure has. I personally prefer Hershey's, but yeah, I'm pretty impressed. I think we're gonna head back over to do Justice League next. And then make our way back over to Jersey Devil and Nitro. Looks like they're still using uh, this archway that they uh, made for uh, Summer Vibes. They used it as well for Fry Fest. Good to see it. It looks like they're using uh, reflections of the dead area as holiday craze mirror maze. 
So that same mirror maze that's there for reflections of the dead, looks like it's still used here for holiday in the park. Change of plans, we're actually going to do Skull Mountain, okay? Here we are. I love this poinsettia tree right here. Very cool. Alright guys, time for Justice League. Centennial Park. And here is LexCorp headquarters, where we believe they're holding Supergirl, The Flash, Green Lantern, and now Wonder Woman. Our mission is to get inside three the main members that are doing your mission. There's also a digital dashboard display that tracks the number of bad guys you blast, and that determines where you get placed in the city. We'll need our best fighters in the most dangerous battles. Speaking of blasting bad guys, you can't do that. Ooh, oh, with all that shiny thing he's got on. We made that pretty penny just setting it for scrap. <laughs> By the way, where's that? Oh, Trusting you. Instead of fighting him, you'll be much better off going home and waiting for this crowd to run to back in your windows. And enjoy the ride! I said, put it away, Joker! Hey, don't worry, team. I've developed an inoculation gas to protect you from the effects of Joker's laughing gas. As you saw, the Joker gas is a green color, while the inoculation gas is blue. Inhaling the blue antitoxin will keep you safe temporarily. I'll hit you with a cloud of this stuff as you break the hold of her lasso of truth. <laughs> Well, I think we broke it because then now it just went down, so yeah. I personally think that this wild mouse is a lot better than the one at Hershey. The one at Hershey sucks. I'll tell you, it's it's it, it's very uncomfortable. This one, it's a kind of different restraint system. It's more of a lap bar, whereas that one's also a lap bar. But each, unlike that one at Hershey, each rider has their own separate lap bar and kind of got an oh shit bar that you can grab onto. But yeah, it's a lot better than the one at Hershey. The Great Adventure, they have all these characters that are out. This is the Evergreen, Evergreen Queen. But then uh, there's also one for the uh, Poinsettia Princess or something like that. That's over by those Poinsettia trees I was showing you earlier. But yeah, it's, that's kind of cool.
and well guys that's gonna do it tonight from great adventure for holiday in the park my first ever visit uh it was a great time as some of you uh hershey people uh know that have been going to christmas candy lane probably noticed with me uh a lot of the similarities uh and those great adventure people that watch my channel um probably notice a lot when i post uh my christmas candy lane videos so it was a great time um I will be at Hershey again on Sunday, um, so it will be a great time. So be sure to hit that like button if you enjoyed this. Be sure to leave a comment for me, and I'll see you guys next time. Bye-bye, guys.